Okay, so I'm trying to figure out all the prime numbers, like I said before. Um, some of the things that I figured out about the modulars were that they were the non-prime numbers, which were 2 and 3. And there also is a few other, a few other prime numbers that are not prime numbers, which I can't, I don't know what they are yet, but I'm hoping somebody can help me out with. So, uh, this equation. This equation right here is to help find out whether or not I'm close to um, the answer that I'm looking for. I wanted to put plus at the top and then not divide because I don't know if you can divide straight across or if you can then that's what I would do. To make mod 3 in a, into a positive. And I go down under the bottom and do mod 6, mod 2, mod 5, plus mod 2 squared, plus mod 0 out, which I, if I can explain it, it's, it's just a mod without a 0, so it goes 1 and negative 1. Just, then that's one, and I I started to divide it by six times four. Uh, I think it's plus twenty four, or my minus is minus two plus one. Uh, six, sorry about that. Is is minus two plus one, minus three, minus a positive or negative three times 9 plus 6 times mod 3 plus mod 1 2 congruent to 5 and then mod zeroed out to add 2 or to add 21 times 2 congruent to 6 and then after that after you use that answer you use 10 times the answer that you get for the last one. And it's, it's almost a few, it's, it's a few answers actually, or if, if not, you'd have to stop the answer, so you'd have to make it zero or something at the bottom. And then, um, to cancel it out, the mod, uh, and then I put plus 11 congruent to 21, or zeroed out to 21. So it was 11, and then 21 would be its own, and tangent 8 times, divided by tangent 8 times the power of 8 to the power of 8, divided by 4 times 2, plus 0 congruent to 2, and that zeroed out by mod 1, or by mod 11. So as you can see, I'm trying to find out whether or not I'm right about this. This is brand new to me. Uh, I just started modulars maybe about four days ago or three days ago, and I already showed you guys what I was doing with it. It was this stuff right here. Right there is the modulars that I was working with. These were continued on. The second ones, were, the second ones on, the, on the right side were continued on from what they were on the left side. And then this, this is all brand new after that, and that this one's brand new after that. Um, but then I figured out there was these ones. At least some of them are, and some of them aren't. But I, when I figured that out, I kind of, I don't know if it should be 4, it, it shouldn't be square rooted of anything, but. And then this is the original equation that I had, right here. Plus, uh, is equal to, at first, mod 2 squared, plus mod... Zeroed out to one 
And you multiply that by the answer, obviously, but I didn't want to multiply it, so I should always going to just add it and subtract it. So, I mean, I, that might work, too. But still, I like, there's something about this equation that makes sense to what I was talking about when I had figured it all out. Uh, for some reason, there's something to this equation that I like. And I'm not sure what it is. But if you want to help me out, please send me a message on Facebook. Message me, please, or something, or a text. I don't have a phone or anything, so it's hard to find out where I got all this. Or it's hard to find out where you find me, so... Um, if you're a friend of mine, just call me. If you're not a friend of mine, but you are someone who's a physicist or something who wants to figure out this answer, I say call me or we can work on it together. If you're using any of my answer, I'm going to have to go ahead and call a lawyer. If I don't, do it in the next three days. I'll do it in the next two days. All right. Thank you. Bye.